West, I'm in Studio 7, and this is being shown on YouTube West. Got my hat on, that's right. It's a World War II Marine type movie, but this is a Navy type hat. And why? Because we're going to talk about something that seems odd. That's right, we're going to talk about a World War II comedy called Operation Petticoat. So, it's a World War II movie, but it's a comedy. That's right, so guess what? We don't need this because it's both. And when you do one, you do the other, you kind of look at them and you're going, man, this ought to get interesting. And believe me, it does. Let's start with who's in it. Who's in it? Cary Grant, Tony Curtis, Dina Merrill, who, Dina Merrill at the time, Marion Ross, who we all remember as Mom Cunningham, and various other individuals, including a wonderful Dick Sargent, who would later be on Bewitched, are all in this movie, and then the cast rounds out from there with people like Gavin McLeod. It's a great movie. Why is it a great movie? Because it starts from the cast down, and then it moves to the direction. Blake Edwards. If you like comedy, the 60s, 70s, and in this case, 50s, 1959, you're going to like Blake Edwards, because this guy knew comedy, and he knew comedy that fixed the whole bill. This is clean comedy. Now, if you want to try some dirty comedy, see a movie called S.O.B. That's the one where Julie Andrews and Rosanna and Kent both take their shirts off. So, something to see in this guy's career, because it spans so far. What's wonderful about this movie is the story. It starts at the beginning of World War II. Yes, I'm going to tell you about it. And they're trying to get a submarine out from the Philippines back into the war because the darn thing is having issues. Its issues aren't just the fact that it's been shot at, it's been sunk, and they managed to raise it again, and it's being put together with spare parts that are stolen from everywhere. It's how they steal the parts. It's the paint they use on the boat because everybody knows the story of the pink submarine, and this is it. It's a great story. It's a wonderful story. It's two hours and four minutes of pure laughing comedy that's clean and it's fun for the whole family. They're wonderful people. It's a wonderful tale, and it keeps you interested. And Tony Curtis's performance is something that I find myself quoting all my life. And I want to give you a quote from Star Trek. That's right, Star Trek, the next generation, Ferengi quote. In confusion, there is profit. As we say in Hollywood, something stolen from somewhere else, if it has value, if it is worth copying. And in this 7 out of 7 production, that's one of the phrases that gets lifted all the time in other movies. Because it's Tony Curtis's phrase, it says the whole thing. Now, we're going to go one more further thing, and we're going to give you the music. Because I always talk about music, and you guys go, man, this guy is into music. Yes, I am, because of Henry Mancini, who at the time was doing score after score after score after score in Hollywood. And this is why, because he did this as uncredited. This is one of his first attempts at soundtracks, and he does an excellent job doing the movie music for this. Again, the movie's called Operation Petticoat with Cary Grant and Dina Merrill and the rest of the bunch, and it's wonderful. Spend the evening, find it on Netflix, look for it on download, see the movie. For Studio 7, I'm Bob West on YouTube West. Thank you very much.